Hi, good morning. I just woke up. It's your boy Gift. How you doing? Uh, we're gonna be going to Pokemon, as you can tell. We're in the office. Um, I don't have all my boxes here as normal because I've been organizing for the last couple of hours. It's currently 8.15 in the morning. I spent the last two hours organizing some cards and I'm still not even halfway done. So, we're gonna head to Critical Hit today with a good friend from last week. I think you remember Dylan from last week. It's gonna be a lot of fun. So, buckle up. We're gonna get some cards. We're gonna have some fun. And I'll see you guys then. Whatever. Seven. Yeah. Um, oh man. Some very nice stuff. Oh my god. You, I still need those for a set. Ooh. Definitely got those ones as well. I opened Zashin against him. I opened Zashin the match before against him. Ah. I didn't play Zashin ever again. Oh yeah, that's why you're not playing it. Oh, you have the same thing here. I bought all these. Right, I put this deck together, and then I didn't like it, so I went back to Umbreon. Oh, yeah, Umbreon's good. It really is. Ooh, I need that one. For Umbreon, the well. on Arceus is great. These are all the trainers. Wow, it's pretty good right there. So just made a trade. This one. Ooh, definitely a little glare there. Definitely one of my favorites so far. That is really cool looking art. Holy cow. And we're going to be using these two for some deck making as well. Came back from Critical Hit. I would record a little bit more, but it was very busy today. Like, more than normal. So, I uh, kind of just took a step back and uh, just played Pokemon with some friends. Um, made some friends with some people. Taught some kids how to play Pokemon. It's a very good day. All about positivity here. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Absolutely awesome. I did get some packs here, so we are going to open some when we get back home. And I'm going to show a couple of things I've been doing the last couple of days here. And we're going to get to it very, very soon. So, just got back from Pokemon. Uh, ignore the mess of everything you see around here. This is what I've been working on since I came back from uh, Critical Hit today. Didn't do as much recording as I thought, but... All these cards are going in this lovely, lovely box here. Everything is still getting organized. It's going to be a little bit of a, a little bit of a treasure trove here tonight. There you go. Um, so we're going to get to the studio now and work on some cards. All right, and we are back once again in the gift studio. Hey, wait a minute. Where's your brother? Oh, man, I, I need to get you. Why are you on the floor? How did you get there? Hello there. Oh, so that's your excuse. I see. Okay, what do you say if you want me to put you on top of your brother again? That's not the correct answer. Okay, that works for me. Alright. We'll laugh again. You only get to be a part of this because you sit on top of your brother's head. Like a good boy. That's exactly what I thought. <clears throat> Alright, welcome back. I didn't do as much recording as I did in Critical Hit today. Um, I'm still not used to, you know, holding recording, or, what do you put? <laughs> oh no, hold on a sec. Uh, I'm not used to the whole recording out in public sort of deal, so, I, I'm, I still have, you know, anxiousness about it, but, you know, here I am today. So, uh, today to kind of end this off here, I've got some lovely packs here to kind of go and work our way through. And I will, I have plans for a video on Monday that I will be talking about today. So, looking at the packs here, um, we have got some packs that I picked up from Critical Hit. We got more packs here from Critical Hit today uh, that I purchased. Um, shout out to Critical Hit Games. Really good, really cool guys. You should go check them out. Good price on cards. Good fun times. Good people. I like them. Very, very down to earth guys. Very homely. So, uh, this one girl in front of me today, uh, she bought one pack of cards, Scarlet and Violet specifically, and pulled not only the full art <laughs> Iron Treads. I already have that card, by the way, but um, the other card that she pulled was the Golden Nest Ball. I got nothing. I bought, I bought, I bought another Scarlet and Violet pack, but I didn't get anything out of that. So, hopefully we can get a nice double pack. I'm going to do the Pal Day Evolves first, because... I don't know. I like these more. I'm going to move that right here. That way I got more arm space. We'll do the Chien Pao first. Um, 
Thank you guys for coming back again. I appreciate anyone that comes back to the channel. Make sure you hit the like and the subscribe button and ring that bell if you guys want to know when my videos are coming out. Oh, you are the wrong one. I thought I was looking at the code card. Here you go. That's what it is the one. There you go. What I was saying. Um, make sure if you guys want to know when my content's coming out, make sure you hit that. Uh, hit that. Hit that bell. The bell. The little bing. The bell. That way you know when my content will be coming out. We'll notify you on your devices about when my content will be coming out. Thank you very much. We are going to start us off by going into a Fighting Energy, followed by a Shinx, Pikachu, Slackoth, I need to move this just slightly down, Watchroll, Quaxwell, that's going to dance its way off my hand, the Livery Drone, for Rigorath, our first reverse is a Magikarp, our second reverse is a Bramblin, and the rare is going to be a Saru Ledge. How very nice. Sarah Ledge was a nice Pokemon, because I think um, I got Violet. I didn't get Scarlet. So, I believe in Scarlet, you get Armor Rouge. And I got Sarah Ledge after the evolved form of Charcadet. Which is very cool. I do like the kind of like two different styles of Pokemon evolve to. Almost like bugs. Like bug Pokemon getting two different forms of evolution. Like Wormpole going into Silcoon or Cascoon. And then going either into... Um, what is it? Uh, Beautifly or Dust Talks. I always like that kind of style. Okay. Uh, we have got ourselves a Grass Energy to start us off here. Followed by Dino, Sandy Gast, Tarantula, Murkrow, Grafii, Say Titan, Faulkner. Our first reverse haul is a Fletchling. Our second reverse haul is a Sneasel. And the rare is going to be a Tyranitar. Showing up with the big gaping mouth saying, hey, how you doing? Very good. Very cool. I'm just going to keep this all in one big pile over here. Here we go. Next, last pack of Paldea Evolved. Um, the weather in Maryland has been very chaotic lately. It's been from very, very warm the last couple weeks. Now it's like in the, the mid-80s. It's very good. Very nice day to go for a walk. Get some fresh air. Walk the dogs for a little bit. I don't have any dogs. <laughs> so if you got dogs, walk them for me. <laughs> We got that basic fire energy with a Raylor, a Tadbulb, Frigibax, Tandemouse, Passimian, Reversal Energy, Therapeutic Energy, with a Reverse Iono, a Reverse Hollow Quaxley, and the rare is going to be a Pax Caliber. Pax Caliber Holographic. Well, nothing out of the uh, pad they evolved. It's kind of been my trend recently. Um, so we have five packs of Scarlet and violet to rip open to very excited i do need some more cards just deck wise because i give some of the little kids at my store um or critical hit i say my store but it's critical hit um i give the kids you know extra cards they may need for their deck not necessarily like you know the whole idea of full arts but you know the idea of giving them um the bunch of like you know spare cards like cards I may need, Professor's Research, Nest Balls, Ultra Balls, that kind of stuff. Cards I may need for a deck, stuff that I may not need. All right, we've got ourselves a Metal Energy to start, followed by Spurgatito, Houndour, Drifloon, a Satoddle, a Experience Share, Stonjourner, Penny, reverse, first Reverse Hollow is a Professor's Research, speaking of which, the second Reverse Hollow is a Clauncher, and the rare is going to be a Hollow Skeledurge. Skeledurge coming out here with... That big bad breath he's spewing out of his mouth. Cool stuff. Good, good, good. All good here. Um, all these cards need to go over here just a little bit more. There you go. Okay. Next man up. Next pack up, I should say. Not next man up. <laughs> what am I, am I saying? Oh, good gracious. All right. Code card there. And we are going to sweep. There you go. And we've got a Psychic Energy to start, followed by Metatite, Energy Search, Grimer, Bruxish, Ultra Ball, Espathra, Arvin, the first reverse is a Torkoal, the second reverse, ooh, Panic would like that one, she loves Dash Bun, and the rare is going to be a Cryodon. Cool stuff. Oh, what in the rick are you going? You're going over there, dear sir. That's where the pal day evolves at. That's not where you belong. Oh, no, they did a backflip. I'm sorry. 
Okay. Three more packs. Let's get them open. I need them open now. You need to give it to me. Give it to me now. Come on. Sorry. That was a little loud. <laughs> loud. <laughs> if anyone can tell, I'm a big Arnold Schwarzenegger fan. Love his movies. Um, as a preschool cop, I think that one he did. I don't know if that's the exact same name of it, but I'm probably wrong. Uh, we got Fighting Energy with a Shuppet, a Spricatito, Houndour, Drifloon, Pachirisu, Picnic Basket, Bombardier. We got first reverse hollows of Smoliv, second reverse hollows of Shuppet, and the rare is going to be a Maridon. Uh-oh. We're striking out here. It's getting just a little scary. Oh, no. It's getting scary. All right. And we're going to the last two packs now. I am still waiting for that Obsidian Flames case to come in. It will be here hopefully very soon. I know it's supposed to be released on the 11th. Um, hopefully it comes in very quickly by time. Not the fall, not this coming Monday, but the next one. Hopefully be ready for a video then. We got basic lightning energy with a fiddle. Shroomish. Manky. Charcadet. Whoa, my tongue just did a little dance. I don't need my tongue to dance. I need my tongue to talk. Miriam. Lucario. Rock chest plate. First reverse is the Dedane. Oh, look at that. We've got that trainer gallery, Dolive, and the rare is going to be a Halucha. Well, I can at least leave something up. And that is going to go into the trade binder because I believe I already have a Dolive. Um, that I pulled before I started doing these videos and stuff like that. So, Dolliv, you get to come into the... Uh, you want to work. And there you go. Hang out oh, over here where the cool kids are at the cool kid lunch table. And all these cards are going to go over here. We got one more pack here to open today. And then we're going to end off this video here, unfortunately. Why, Halucha, Maraidon, why are you guys over there? You guys are supposed to be over here where the cool kids are at. You guys are going over where Pal Day Evolved is? I know they got cool kids over there too, but at the same time, like, uh, you got to do some stuff over here too, you know? All right, last pack magic hopefully comes in strong. We're looking for two pulls here. Two pulls, that's all we need. We got that basic leaf energy, grass energy. We got Troopius, Pokeball. Rotom, Palpad, Fortress, Rocky Helmet. We got that Mabo Stiff, and our first Reverse Hollow is the Annihilate, followed by a Scatterbug, and the last card for today is going to be, ah, uh, it is going to be a Houndstone. Very unfortunate, but we've got ourselves a nice little Dolliv here that's going to go into the trade binder for a lucky, lucky person out there to enjoy. Hi, Gift made a noobsie. Before he wanted to open up the packs, he wanted to show everyone here the lovely trades that he got today. And we're gonna be adding them all into this lovely Crown Zenith binder because guess what? They're all Crown Zenith. So we're gonna get started here. So the first one here, well actually most of them are Crown Zenith, I should say. So we're gonna be starting up here with the Crown Zenith stuff. We have got a lovely, Radiant Charger Bug. I didn't even know this one was in the set. This one is really cool. Whenever any player attaches an energy from one of their hands to one of their V Pokemon, they put two damage counters on that. Very cool. We've got the Hisuian Samurott V Star. Very ominous vibes against a poor, defenseless little snow runt. And then we've got the Zashian V Star that is in Crown Zenith as well. Followed by one of my favorites in here, the Hatterene V Max, looking over the little Fey Forest, which I think is very, very cool. So we are going to add these to the binder right here and now. Now that I'm actually able to get that out of my system. <coughs> so, looking at the binder here, we have got, we are looking for number 51. So it is going to be 49, 50. 51 or just beneath the electric here there we go now the next one up is going to be the zashian v star which is number 
What did the number say? 96. So we're going to continue over to the metal section here. Yahtzee. Oh, one, two, four. Come on back here. So we have, we've got number 94, 95, 96. If you want to go into the sleeve part, there you go. Very nice. All right, next one on the list is going to be the Hattering VMAX at Galarian Gallery number 47. There is a lot of Galarian Galleries in this. Way too many, but fun. So, okie dokie, we are looking to go to the next page here where, as you can see, the little, the little God Squad's at. God Squad knows it's up. So, 35, 38, 41. You're 47. Shit. Get back on the other side here. Hiya. So we've got the Axis V Star and the Hatterene V Max 46, 47, right there. And last but not least, for the Crown Zenith is going to be his Suin Samurott V Star coming in at number 52, 47, 50, 51, 52. Coming right at you. Right there you go. Very nice stuff. I love it. I love it. Very good. Now, we're going to move on to the next binder. And the last binder, which is going to be my Paldea Evolved binder. And I'll be honest, this one's seen some wear and tear, so be nice about it. It's all about the love. All right. So first up to start with, we've got two cards here that we're going to be looking at. We've got a Golden Quaquaval EX, and we've also got... The Trainer Gallery Slowpoke, that isn't in the correct set. Why are you here? Why are you here? What was the purpose of me getting you? I forget. Gift is having another meltdown. My brain go boom. Um, so Slowpoke, you belong in Scarlet Violet. We'll get you there in a second. Golden Quaco Vol EX. You're going to go. I dropped another card. Gift really is having a hard time today. You're going to go all the way into the back here going all the way past all these other cards who needs these cards i sure as heck say we don't need them get out of here cards keep going i think we got one more page Wait. sure do we've got the golden meow scarada we've got the golden scale of dirge we've got the golden quack wall a little hard with the glare but there you can see it it's right there there you go very nice stuff and we got Officially, one more binder to open, and that's going to be Slowpoke. <clears throat> Slowpoke came slow to the race and forgot to tell me, Hey, Gift, I'm not in that set. Oh, are you? No. Oh, great. Thanks for coming to the party late, Slowpoke. But I do like the art on this. I really want to say uh, the artist, uh, Toshino Aoki, um, I think he also did the artwork for the Pidgey, the alternate art Pidgey lines, like the Pidgey, Pidgeyo, Pidgeyoto, and Pidgeyot. I want to say that's him. Okay, so we are looking for number 204. We're not on the right page. We're going to go back one. There we go. So we have number 202, 203, and 204. This binder is starting to look very, very nice. And there you go. That's it. Now, that's all the cards we got to put in here that are brand spanking new into our binders. Without further ado, let's throw it back to Gift. Uh, so, we're actually going to throw it back to where I originally left off at the earlier part of the video, opening up card packs, and then talking about next week. And all that. We're going to be looking at and find some new product being released by uh, the Pokemon Company right before Obsidian Flames is due to release next Saturday. One week from this recording. Actually, no, less than a week. Friday. Friday is when it's going to be recorded. So, I hope you all have a great day. Make sure you all stay awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.